Adelaide's really turned it on for the International Rugby Sevens World Series. <laughs> you don't get much beefier than rugby. <laughs> Today we're asking what's the ballsiest thing you've ever done? Still in the car to get here. <laughs> and have you been caught yet? Not yet. You guys are pretty ballsy to dress up today. Whose idea was this? Yeah, it was mine. Yeah, my idea. I don't know, I don't know where the ballsiest thing I could put on camera was. <laughs> How rude can I get? Uh, Tell us, really juicy stuff. Shagging a woman in the main street. Jumped over a fence trying to climb over someone's garage and end up falling through and landing on a lawnmower. Uh, last year I dislocated my shoulder twice. Have you had any injuries? Oh uh, yeah, I broke my finger. Oh, we trespassed and threw massive logs in someone's pool. Right. And then we threw a deck chair in there as well. That was pretty funny. <laughs> went to Twickenham a couple of years back and we went through about um, 30 pints in a day. Wow. And what did you do when you had all that to drink? Um, went and that. <laughs> <laughs> You're adventurous. I got locked up for last night. I don't remember what happened. I got to court on Monday morning. <laughs> <laughs> do you like the rugby? Yeah. yeah. What do you like about it? The boys. the boys. Tell me why you like the rugby so much. You get to smash people? Or fun? Um, swam with the shark in Scotland. I can't tell you half this stuff, sir. I'm from Glasgow, mate. Uh, Pampalona running of the bulls? That's what there's couple of Europe, man. First I'll tell you bad stories, then it is pretty bad. How's Lois Lane going? Oh, she's average, actually. I never really thought much of her, but, um, you know, it's a TV show. You've got to, to go with clothes. So. Crazy sex stories with Miss Lois. you ever do it in the telephone booth? I, I, I shit myself on business class. Why? Why? Because I'd been drinking in too much. Well, the craziest, manliest thing that he's ever done is about to run across the pitch streaking naked. I heard you were with a couple of strippers last night. How no, 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 not a couple. There was about three or four of them. Oh, three or four of them. <laughs> <laughs> uh, one time about 300 young people walking past my place. One of them kicked over my uh, mailbox. So I grabbed my golf club and ran outside and confronted them all. <laughs> we've heard the stripper stories, we've heard the adventure sport stories, we've even heard poo stories. The atmosphere is crazy, it's like a festival carnival atmosphere. I'm Olivia Stratton, this is The O-List and I'll see you next week.